Well, when motorized golf carts rolled onto the scene in the 1960s, they literally drove the caddies off the course. Uh, but their days are not numbered, at least not now, for the bag slingers at the Victoria Golf Course, where the art of caddying has come back in a big way. And as news reporter Aaron Glazier shows us, one caddy will have a brighter future because of it. Hey, Alex. Hey, how are you? Alex Adams wasn't a golf club swinging prodigy at age three. Uh, I'd watched it a bit on TV, but other than that, other than the basic rules, not really that much. He picked up an iron for the first time four years ago when he entered the Chick Evans Caddy Program at the Victoria Golf Club. Chick Evans started out as a caddy. He didn't golf at all himself, but he learned to golf as a caddy and became quite a phenomenal golfer. His parents were not able to send him to university, and when he started winning, he put the money in a trust and the very first two Evans scholarships were given out in 1930. Caddies who carry a bag on the PGA Tour are paid very well, but the high-end gigs are few and far between. So after being awarded the Chick Evans Honours this year, Adams will take his paycheck, a $50,000 scholarship to the University of Colorado and study engineering. The scholarship will help me achieve my bachelor's in engineering and then I hope to go on from there to become an engineer and probably come back to Canada to work. When it comes to being a good caddy, Adam says the ability to read the green, politeness, and knowing what not to do on the course will give you good ball karma. Ah. Oh, the, devil. the man's a menace. To qualify for the scholarships, Adams had to caddy over 80 rounds of golf on these picturesque fairways, maintain a straight-A average at Oak Bay High School, and pass a rigorous American college exam. But those who know the young club calculator say the opportunity is well-deserved. The most important thing was how he uh, conducted himself with the members and, and uh, um, you know, spoke well and, and uh, behaved himself, of course, uh, all, all the time and, and uh, was just a treat to have around. Adams is set to trade in his clubs for some books. He'll be touring the Boulder campus next week and he says he'll look back fondly on his time on the links caddying for some KG veterans. It's picking yourself back up if you get in trouble on a hole and still finding a way to make a par. In Victoria, Aaron Glazier, A News.